Hello, I'm Jerry Ford. I'm gonna show off some of my cars. This uh, this case isn't something to show off though. It's this is a beat up case. I got this at a garage sale many many years ago. Um, I think it even had this slice down the side of it. But uh, I think it had some cars in it, so I just went ahead and just it was a good price for the whole bunch. The ones that are in here wasn't in here then, but uh, um, it had it had uh, it had the blue racks in there, you know, to put the cars in, and uh, those are not in here anymore. I used them in another in other cases or something like that. But uh, um, I had this with um, I wrote on here hot rods customized and. Uh, show cars and that's what I had in here for a while but now it just kind of became a, a miscellaneous assorted stuff that I can't a lot of it I can't fit in uh, in regular case you know the little blue individual case uh, I mean yeah case racks so I don't like to have them in here like this display uh, I don't like having them in, in here like this but um, it's kind of the way it happened. Um, but yeah, it's just a miscellaneous bunch. And you know, maybe you guys will enjoy seeing, seeing the different ones that are in here. Um, but uh, let's see. Let's start off with, uh, with this one. Some of these are old. This is a mini Trek. Hot Wheels metal bottom metal top you ever seen one of those before it's like a you know, people would buy these for traveling. Um, I don't remember if I ever seen any of these actually on the road. Maytel Incorporated. Is that a date? Let's see. Nineteen eighty. Nineteen eighty. Mini Trek. Hot Wheels. It's got a like a tan color. Tan color. Um, it has some uh, some decal or it has uh, some pinstriping of an orangish color and a yellow, kind of making a sideways J. I guess you could kind of say, kind of say. Um, has an upper window up top and a moon window, moon roof, sunroof. I think these had an upper level back there where they had like beds that you could climb up in back inside there. Doesn't really show inside, but then had these little side windows here. It's not a door. That I, that I, yeah, I don't think it's a door, but, um, let's look it up. 1980 Mini Trek, let's see if it says anything about the make of that, I'm kind of curious. There's a picture of it. This one has some chips on it. You can buy it on eBay for $15.99 used. It calls it a camper truck.
Yeah, it doesn't say the make of it. How about let's just put in mini track. Let's see what that says. Okay. I guess it was an actual I guess it wasn't an actual vehicle that used to go into images. And now it's just showing bikes and all that kind of stuff. French Masters of the Universe. What? Oh. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. I got some different colors and different designs and stuff, but um, when you look at the front end, it kind of has a maybe. Maybe a Ford. Maybe a Ford. But I don't know if it's actually meant to be any make, you know. What do you guys think? Anyway. Spent a lot of time on that one. On showing it off. What else we got here? Yeah, I don't like keeping some of these in, in there. Um, let's see. Two thousand. Oh, playing mantis. It's got rubber tires. United States Navy ambulance. It says ambulance up here. United States Navy in there. Um. The hood says USA, and it says a number on there, probably. Um, this hood looks like it opens. I can't remember. Oh, okay, there it goes. It's pretty cool. It has an axe and a shovel on the side over here on the side of it for emergencies, digging people out maybe, and then it's got a spare tire on the other side in the middle between the wheel wells there. Shows a door, has some has some good detail. Even underneath the axle and the transmission and, and the uh, muffler going out the side there, the tailpipe. Yeah, it's, the top is metal, it's heavy, the bottom is plastic though. It rolls really nice, really nice for rubber tires, wow. Um, I think it's meant more for a, a display car though, but, and you got the back there doesn't open um it's got the uh, the headlight guards on there 
keep rocks and stuff from breaking out the headlights because these were kind of meant for I think you know dirt roads and maybe a little off-roading with it yeah I'm not sure of the make it may have said on the package when I got it but what else we got here you ever traveled in one of these things? It's got a tow hitch on there. <clears throat> I just happen to have a little camper. Let's see. Does it go on this? No, it doesn't fit on there very good. I mean, it'll set on there and you can... When it gets to a bump, you lose your... You lose your little camper camper says 1999 hasbro to tonka yeah tonka yeah it says tonka on the side too over here anyway it says tonka on the back that's some nice detail back there you could wire into your tail lights <clears throat> This is meant for, for one of the other vehicles to tow. But this little thing here, this little rolling camper RV, and the door shuts on there and you can open it. <clears throat> got a little side window here. You got um, some kind of ventilation type thing up here. Can't remember if that's just like a, a top air conditioning type system or what that is. Uh, it says truck camper from Matchbox. Oh, okay. See this thing right here? You can open up the door like that, close it. It's white. <clears throat> the camper, the rolling camper was white on top and red on the bottom, which was metal. It had no, has a plastic bottom, but it has a metal hitch on it. The top is plastic. And uh Let's see, this, the bottom is plastic on this little rolling camper RV thing. Has some decals on it, some, pin, some pinstripe going down the side, and some decorative type of purple and pinkish colors. Kind of look like water like splashing up or something. The front of it has a big old windshield on it. The back has a ladder back here to get up top there, probably to work on your air conditioning type thing or whatever. But yeah, it's a, uh, didn't roll too bad. But yeah, this was a matchbox and this was a Tonka trailer. What else we got? Where are we at? Okay. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Here's another. That's like one of those pop-up campers. Oh, and it pops up. <laughs> it's uh, got a white plastic top on it that pops up. <clears throat> Um, it's got the tow hitch on it for tow for being for, for it to be towed. It is also a uh, <coughs> matchbox pop up camper, is what it's called. 1999 Maytel Incorporated has some pretty good detail. Has the, the pull down like sun shield on the side there. Um, so you can see in this side there's it actually has a actually has a sink in there some seats um, oh it actually has a person laying in there right back there in the back I don't know if you can see them very good um, yeah. it's got two Two little pole campers there. The 
this one here yeah it's red on the bottom white on top it's got some pinstriping actually has uh the road it's the road kind of painted on the side of it what else oh whoa, i got another one in here i don't remember having another pop-up trailer i got two of them huh that's surprising Recycle America. This is a Peterbilt, I think it says on the front. Yeah, Peterbilt truck, trash truck. Has the, the gas tanks on both sides. Has the big um, side... Uh, exhaust pipe going out the side there by the driver's side um so the cab is metal the back trash truck um container is plastic a waste management service is what it says on the side um on the bottom which is metal it says 19, 1991 Road Champs Incorporated, Caldwell, Mrs. Missouri, no, New Jersey, then has a number, Road Champs. The wheels in, in the bottom is like new. The cab is, eh, it's a little chipped up, a little scratched, but it rolls really nice. I'm curious if that, see in the back there? I'm just curious if it came out, but it doesn't look like it does. Oh, it's missing, see the hinge holes up here? It's missing a cover for that. But anyway, yeah, trash truck. Where are we at on time? 1741. Got a boat trailer. It's got a boat in there. It says, oh, it's a police launch. It's a police boat. Oh, it's a Tonka. Huh, the trailer. Tonka 1999 Hasbro. Got another boat in here. It's a it's a it's a nice one. Um, it's actually metal on the bottom. It's a 2001 Plain Mantis Incorporated. The engine moves. It's got. Tom Mann says on the top in there. Oh, Johnny Lightning. I don't have a trailer for this one. This here says gliding club, so I guess it holds a glider toy inside there. This is an oldie. It's a matchbox, super fast, TP-7 made in England, glider transporter, 1978 Lesney Products Incorporated. metal on top of plastic the wheels are in good shape they're plastic good. 
even without anything hooked to it, it rolls pretty good. I was just kind of wondering if the boat would sit in there. Actually, not too bad. <laughs> All right, 20 minutes. Got to see a few things. I took a little time on some. Just kind of explaining them, trying to figure out what they were for sure. But there you go. All right. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And we'll look at some more um, later. All right.